Hey, what's going on? I'm Big True, a 32-year-old guy doing his thing here in North Carolina. And for the past eight years, I've worked as a radio personality at Radio 1 of Raleigh. I'm a huge fan of hip-hop music so much that I created a podcast called The Brand New Flavor Show. It features a lot of independent hip-hop artists from around North Carolina. And last but not least, I'm a member of Phi Beta Sigma Fraternity Incorporated, an organization of men who believe in the principles of brotherhood, scholarship, and service. And at times, things can get pretty hectic around here, but I have to say, I lead a pretty interesting life. But you know what the funny thing is? This isn't even half of what I do. I'm Big True, and welcome to my world. Yo. So today I start my, my web blog. What is blog? What are your topics? Um, I don't know. Well, today it's, 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 the, it's just about random stuff that I do. So today it's about the cookout. I mean, does it really matter? I mean, we can talk about the fact that Stuart sends out an email saying I got a new family member but doesn't leave a name. I mean, you know, we can talk about stuff like I saw that. that. What is her name? I he mean, actually told us the name before. I think it's Bianca or something. Oh yeah, it is Bianca. You're right. Rich said he got a. Um, he said he got. The, he got a room by himself. He was like, true man, if you will come up, you just crash in the room. I was like, wow. The fact right. that he's going to Vegas has a room by himself says a lot about Rich. Man. What does it say? Who does that? I mean, what? I mean, he, he got money like that. I mean, it's nigga, not about the money. It's about the fact that you're going to Vegas. He can't find, he can't find nobody to go with you, sis. I don't think he really wanted to go with anybody, though. That is, that's, once again, that says a lot about you. You want to go to <laughs> Vegas by yourself. I mean... If I was going by myself, for instance... Who are you going, going with? with? I'm going actually uh, my line brother then too, my childhood brother. But if someone, if all three of those guys canceled and I couldn't find anyone else to go with me, I wouldn't go. I wouldn't go out there by myself. Why? Like, I don't want to go to this cookout this one by myself, so I called you. That's just me. Oh, yeah. Then, then I, I'd probably scare you. I, I, I'll go to the movies by myself in a heartbeat. Yeah, moment. that's scary. No, what's wrong with that, though? I, I have no issue with that. I do. And then I have issues with, like, then sometimes... I you have to eat by myself in a restaurant. Why? Then you like have to read the paper or try to look busy or something. It's just too much. It's not even that serious. It is to me, man. I got maybe I got some social hang up. Yeah, I think you do. Are you putting them out? It's gonna it's gonna melt. It's cooking though. Let it burn a little bit. So, first of all, let me tell you a little about myself. I'm Troy O'Neill. I'm from Washington, D.C. originally. I live here in Durham. And I'm hungry as hell. God, boy. The, the, four, the cookout starts at four. There's no food. There's potato chips. Half done. It's probably beef. Over there too long because I. It ain't beef. What kind of hot dogs are? High school who went to Charleston for like five years. Came back. There's no such thing as chicken hot dog. They have turkey hot dogs. Hey, ain't no such thing as chicken hot dog. Went to Charleston school and came back in high school. We that ain't what's on the grill. I don't think that's beef. That's beef, but there is such thing as chicken hot dogs. So y'all got beef burgers, beef hot dogs, chicken what? We got chicken. I don't know where it's at though. What's hey, up? but look, here's what here's what happened, man. We mm -hmm. first started out with some cheap coals from uh -huh. Family Dollar. Uh -huh. And they weren't burning right now. Uh -huh. And we put them up here. See, hold up, hold up. And, <laughs> but anyway, we put them up there and they weren't working, man. So we had to go get some legit, you know what I'm saying, that keys for y'all that match. Like, you know what I'm saying? Go. Uh, take a deep breath. Suck as much air as your lungs will admit. Then I just bust the shit. I'm <laughs> take two. <laughs> <laughs> My man, he was spending some lines. He spent some lines for him, yo. Some of them sigmas are talented. Yo, so what I'm gonna do areas. is you what I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a topic and you're gonna rhyme on it and then I'm gonna give you another topic and you can rhyme on it. That is a true a true true indicator of uh, a rap style. Alright, so 
So the first word is go mob. Go mob. I guess it's a secret. Everybody's out here in the city of Muslim, keep it. Uh, if I had to say it right now, I'd have to bleep it. Porsche. Porsche. I wish I had that because I have the force. Go pick up any girls, any whores. Rashad. Rashad. Chilling, walking the salmon. Out here tanning. <laughs> <laughs> So today is April the 15th. I just got my taxes done. I'm trying to enjoy myself here at, at the good old Sigma picnic. For what reason, I don't know. But anytime somebody wants to pay money for food, I don't have to pay for it. That's always a good thing. You know what? You can't be the camera. Eddie Murphy, Eddie Murphy. Uh, party, party all the time. Yeah. Party all the time. That was like no. That was funny. I'm putting that on Facebook. <laughs> 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 Put that on Facebook. Put it right next to you in the devil's profile. <laughs> <laughs> it's the devil. So that's it for me today. The cookout was great. Finally got something to eat. The, the, I got I finally got something to eat. And, um, I mean, I got some. I got three chicken wings, a half a spoon of macaroni and cheese, and 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 a rotisserie bucket full of iced tea. So I enjoyed myself. And some cookies. And some cookies with some white ice on it. So I enjoyed my day. Check me out next week for the next installment of Big True's World. Goodbye.